Many folks who are trying to get out of town in Emmett and trying to head to the Treasure Valley typically hop on Highway 16 through this intersection at Substation Road. But lately they've been dealing with a few detours due to a down traffic light. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, and I asked ITD how long these repairs will take. My daughter's bus doesn't go, doesn't run right now. New traffic patterns at the intersection of Highway 16 and Substation Road in Emmett are causing confusion and frustration. So how do I get over there? Can't make the left hand turn. John Tomlinson with ITD says a construction truck clipped the traffic light at the intersection in October and it's been out of commission ever since. And uh, did some severe damage to the base and then also to the electrical equipment. This came just months after substation was closed off on both sides for several weeks. Super frustrating, um, but it's better than when the road was closed off. Cause now at least I can turn right and go to the grocery store, you know, but I just have to go around to come back. That go around that Mary Andrews is referring to is due to the new traffic pattern that is temporarily in place. Now, folks driving north on substation have to turn right on Highway 16, and people heading south will have to turn west. Drivers won't be able to drive through the intersection due to a line of pylons in the middle of the roadway. Those that are on the highway have the flashing yellow, which means to keep driving but, but use caution. And then those that are using substation road, you've got the flashing reds. So we have stop signs and that's all in the name of safety. Going door to door, I met Warren Katchmar, who said he reached out to ITD about the issue last week. He told us at that time, he thought it'd be the end of the year before they have repaired. They wish it could be quicker. I'm not sure how the money budget thing works, but it'd be nice if they could do it quicker. Andrus agreed that quicker would be better, at least for the sake of getting her daughter to school. Because the bus would go straight through the light, so everybody in this neighborhood um, can't ride the bus. So we have to either take her to school or pick her up from school, or she walks home from school. Maybe we're just a small town, but um, it still affects us. Tomlinson says that they hope to have this intersection up and running by the end of the month. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, Idaho News 6.